Welcome back, Bears. I'm Ren. Summer. I'm Jay. Robin. DJ. I'm Aiden. I'm Jacob. I'm Vladimir. I'm Hayes. I'm Nikos. I'm Grief. I'm Tunin. I'm Gabriel. I'm Henry. I'm D. I'm Diego. I'm Lanny. I'm James. I'm Marquis. I'm Zachary. I'm Brandon Bickhorst. I'm Lincoln. I'm Kyrie. I'm Uriah. I'm Daniel. Bears. I'm Annalise. We're recording from the BTV studio. Welcome back, Bears. I'm Summer. And I'm TJ, reporting from the BTV studio. Today is Wednesday, March 10th, and today is Pack Your Lunch Day. So did you bring your lunch to school? I know I didn't. I didn't either. This is a problem. But first, let's take a quick look at today in history. On March 10th, 1876, the first this, the central speech was transmitted over a telephone system when inventor Alexander, Alexander Graham Bell summoned his assistant into another room by saying, Mr. Watson, come here. I want you. Bell received a telephone, a telephone patent just three days before. Now for more recent Bears basketball news. Congrats to class of 2025, Kingston Flemings and Camden Kogel for being selected as the unanimous dis district newcomers of the year. And here's a shout out for senior Xavier Boisley, district sixth man of the year. Also, congrats to class of 2023, Robert Jackson, the unanimous first team all district selection. And to Dion Williams for being voted the unanimous district defense player of the year. Way to go Bears. And congrats to Lady Bears basketball, senior Jillian Torres, Juniors and Raya Adams and sophomore Tyra, Tyra Sotelo on making second team all district. And here's a shout out to junior Elise Sellers for making the honorable mention list. Congrats to all of our Barrows golfers who competed Monday at the at the Palestine Golf Tourney. It was a cold day on the links. Congrats to Sarah, uh, to, to Sarah Walker for playing first overall in the girls division and also the ladies Bears team for taking second place overall. Bears, for those of you nominated for induction into the Spanish Honor Society, be sure to turn in your dues by March 25th to Spanish teacher Daisy Ponce. If you have any questions, please see here in E143. Brennan PTSA continues their jeans, their jeans and prom dress drive, which benefits Northside Threads. So you have, if you have any gently worn jeans and or prom dresses you would like to donate, drop them off in the black box in the front of the receptionist area or the black box by the dance studio. Consider donating. Now for soccer news. Last night, Isabella Hernandez scored another hat trick with three goals as Caitlin Graber and Anna Pera each scored a goal apiece in our Lady Bears soccer team 5-1 win against the J-Lady Mustangs. Goalie Brianna De Luna had two saves. Tomorrow, they face the home Lady Huskies at 7 p.m. at Northside Field 1. Also yesterday, our Bears soccer team scored a 4-1 win with win over the J-Mustangs. Tomorrow, they go up against the home Huskies at 5 p.m. at the Northside Field 1. BFND Bears Soccer. Now on the softball news, Junior Ariana Martinez struck out five batters as our Lady Bears shut out the Taft Lady Raiders 5-0 yesterday. The Lady Bears scored on nine hits, causing the Lady Raiders to commit three errors. Saturday, they face the O'Connor Lady Panthers at noon at Northside Field 2. BFND Lady Bears. And now for baseball news. On Tuesdays, our, Bear, our Bears had a three hits and committed six errors as Brian Navarro scored the only run in the loss to the Southwest Dragons. 10 to 1. Saturdays, our Bear, Saturday, our Bears go up against Stephen Falcons at 2.45 p.m. at Northside Field 2. BFND Bears. Here's a shout out to our junior varsity Bears tennis team. David Plu and Sal Lopez placed first in doubles, Alejandro Gloria first in singles competition, and Yuka Yumara second in singles at Tuesday's tennis competition. Way to go, Bears. Let's wish our Varsity Bears tennis team luck tomorrow at the tournament hosted by Clemens and Stevens High School. Weather permitting. Steel High School. And Steel High School. Steel High School. <laughs> and Steel High School. Weather permitting 13, 13 schools will compete. Finally, here's a shout out to our Special Olympians who are scheduled to compete tomorrow. Continue being brave. Uh, actually, no, scheduled to compete today. Continue being brave in your attempts to win. BF and the Olympians. This is all we have for today. And don't forget to follow us on Beats on Twitter at Beats v Bears. If you have missed any part of this broadcast, catch us by searching us. Catch us on YouTube by searching for BTV Bears. If you have any announcements for BTV, please email Mr. Serna at Fernando.serna at NISD.net. I'm TJ signing off from BTV. Have a great day, Bears, and continue to keep a positive mindset. And I'm Summer. Remember to stay engaged in your learning and, all, and only have one more day remains until spring break. And in Korean, Kom Samira.
This is a BTV production.